The Guam Election Commission office at the GCIC building was packed on the last day of early in-office voting. GEC Executive Director John Blas says he anticipated that between 2,700 to 2,800 people would have casted their votes by the day's end. However, counting the number of in-office votes is just one part of GEC's preparations on the eve of tomorrow's big primary election. It's pretty busy right now. Uh, at the same time, I have staff who are actually uh, rolling equipment up to the University of Guam. Uh, we need to set the, the field house uh, up uh, in preparation for our test election this evening at 6 p.m. Uh, again, the, a lot of things going on at all at the same time. However, it's all part of our uh, election uh, preparation uh, uh, process, so uh, we're confident that we'll set everything up. Uh, in time for our election tomorrow. Blas says about 48,500 people have registered to vote for the primary election. And while officials prepare the tabulators and set up Election Central at the University of Guam Fieldhouse this evening, he adds that tomorrow's turnout is encouraging given the amount of in-office voters that have already showed up. He also reminds the rest of the island community to exercise their right to vote. I'm really encouraged by the in-office voting. Uh, voters are, are taking this election very seriously. So, um, again, uh, I, I hope for a very good turnout uh, in terms of percentage. Uh, I'm going to be very conservative and say maybe 70, 75 percent voter turnout uh, tomorrow. Josh Tikenko, PNC News.